We have just pulled up to the cabin. For a great weekend in the outdoors before bow season starts. We got bow target, bow, still chainsaw. And some axes. Just a couple axes, but we're about to have some fun. All right, so as you guys saw, we are at the cabin and I brought a bunch of axes and I'm gonna have some fun. Um, one of the problems that I always mention, um, I think I've said on video a few times, is these poplar trees that we have. Like right here, for example, this right here, is a beech. Beautiful tree, produces beech nuts, good for the animals. And then right behind it is a nasty poplar. And then right back to the right is another poplar. And back to the left is another poplar. And they're all half dead. There's a maple tree in between these two poplars. There's an apple tree in between the back two. So I wanna get these things on the ground so that these good trees can start to grow and, and produce fruit, and that's better for everyone. So I'm gonna do my face cut. It's a little bit of a pain with this tree that I'm trying to save in the way, but I can do it here. I just farted on camera. So again, 45's down, straight cl cuts to clear the chips. You want to make sure that you keep your corners clean too because this is where it'll st it'll pinch and twist You'll notice I'm not swinging as hard as I can either because I want to have more aim than just sheer power. as I want to go.
So I'm being really particular about how clear that is. But that's because I really want to make sure I know where it goes. Now, there's nothing with this tree that would be hurt if it fell the wrong way. But practice makes perfect. Just cut. Kids are all on the porch. my back swing. I think this tree is going to fall the wrong the other direction the way I didn't want it to fall. Nope, I think we're good. There we go. Well, Perfect. <laughs> That's awesome. Three and a half pound Kelly. I did a lot of work to this handle and did this to the palm swell, but that's got to come off because that was actually aggravating my hand. But I love it that, uh, you know, you set out to do something and, uh, and it works. I'm pretty, pretty happy about this. Gonna bring you more videos from the weekend with the boys axe and uh, a couple other ones that I got. But for right now, I'm gonna go play with the kids and uh, we'll come back later and uh, start cleaning this up. Hit like and subscribe and uh, you know, leave me some comments. You know, let me know if you think I did something wrong in this and uh, I'd love to uh, have some intelligent conversation especially uh, Owen or or Seth um, you guys are good for some intelligent conversation about stuff but uh, let's get some uh, some other people who are 
actually using these things and not just collecting them. Talk to you guys soon. Like and subscribe. Thanks.